So the new Drake album dropped and I used to make house beats back then and I can't lie, I'm feeling the album. So I thought it's, it's essential that I take this opportunity for catching this house music wave. Let me hit them with some house beats and stuff like that, some deep house, whatever. That's what we are gonna do. We are gonna make Drake type house beats today and I'm gonna show you how to make them. We're gonna get to that and I'm gonna show you the steps. But first, I need you to put a like on the video. Help your boy out, help get this up and let's go. So the first thing I'm gonna do is find something really soft, something really cool to play the chords that I'm trying to figure out. For that, I'm gonna to go to Analog Lab. I'm gonna to go to the pads, search around the pads. I think I can work with that. I'm gonna set the tempo to 120. I'm gonna make a chord progression from scratch. So the first thing I'm gonna do is play around to find the first chord. And the first chord is either gonna be some type of seventh or ninth chord. See the notes I'm playing on this chord? I'm gonna take away the third, which is the second note. We're gonna run with that. I'm gonna try and find another chord that works. I don't like that. Let's try something else. Let's try to go to a major instead of a four. Matter of fact, let's find a different sound. I like that, that's a lot softer and it comes in pretty fast. We're gonna change the chord, we're gonna start over. I like how that sounds and that is a major chord. I feel like going down. So I just found this note and I built a chord that I think will sound good with that one. Now I know where I wanna go on this one. I wanna go up and I built that from this top note right here because that's what I heard in my head. That's what I hear in my head, so. Smooth. Now I'm gonna layer that with a piano. I'm not gonna layer it with any type of piano. It's gonna be like one of these bright, funky pianos. Very house music-y. Let's copy it, paste. Now you see how that complements the sound that I just layered it with because that's a very bright, high timbre sound with very little low end. This other sound is very warm and it sits in the mids. Now you remember that? I'm gonna put that in here right now. You got the foundation for the chords. Now what I wanna do, I wanna find some type of pluck that I'm gonna put on the off beats. I'm gonna try this one out. See how it works. Now, if you're not aware what the off beats are, we're gonna zoom in. These are the on beats. If we move these over one, those are the off beats. I'm going to put a static pluck on this note because this note drags through the whole progression. It's sounding like we are at an Italian mall right now. We're, we're, it's going. Now the last melodic piece I wanna find right now is a vocal. Now the question <laughs> with the vocal is what key am I playing in right now? Probably C for real. This is probably a six, five, one. If we do the math, so. This is a C minor scale. And I'm gonna show you something real quick just so you can test it out, so. Uh, All the notes fit. When we look at G, G is right there. When we look at G sharp, that fit as well. So I just counted the scale up, looked at all the notes, they all match, everything is good. So we are in C minor. So for the vocals, I got this Euphoria vocal sample pack from Cymatics. I'm gonna use one of these ad-libs from it. 
Now look, it's not in key. I'm not even about to play around. I, I know this is C minor and I know this is G. I'm not about to even do the calculating. I'm about to just drag the pitch down because I know G is higher than C. We'll drag it until it gets to the point where it sounds good. That was simple, 500 cents, didn't have to do the math, didn't have to say, okay, how many? Nope, I just dragged it. I'm gonna find another one. So this is another G minor. All I have to do is drag it 500 cents, it's gonna work. play with the stretch i'm not even trying to have it like you know is on time is i'm not about to do all that i'm about to just play with it until it works we play until it works that works for me and this is what i'm gonna do as well i'm not even gonna have the bleeding or nothing like that we gonna envelope it out and do that where it cuts itself off so we're in a good place now what i'm gonna get to is some processing on the melody wait 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 let's get some bass on this so i got this open we're trying to find a bass i like the sound of that let's see how that fits so we're not gonna do a sustaining bass line this time around what we're gonna do is play around with the off beats again This is what's about to happen next. I'm about to do a whole bunch of processing and all types of stuff. This is already kind of alive, but this is going to give it more life. Drake pun. You see the Drake pun? gonna do the drums in the combustion volume 2 kit i have a folder of thumpy kicks that's exactly what this needs a thumpy kick because that's what you know house music and dance music be having so i call that kick the undertaker i got this thomas penton drum kit I had it for like a thousand years. And this hat, it sounds very dancey. I'm gonna change that sound. We're gonna find a different sound for that wood percussion. thing that I'm gonna do is take all these put the all the melodic tracks route them to one track take them off the master I'm gonna label this bus melody I'm gonna load shaper box I'm gonna go to side chain now when you listen I'm gonna 
tuck that side chain a little bit more, so I'm gonna move that. I'm gonna move this. Let's listen. <laughs> I'm gonna take this 808, fade it out more, move the length. And we're just gonna do that. Put it under the kick that I already have. Let's isolate the kicks just so you hear it. That's what it's doing. Let's isolate the kick. Let's take that away. You hear, you hear it? You hear it? It'll be heard on the subs. Now let's bring everything back in. We're gonna get to the full beat in a moment. I appreciate you if you made it this far. Please subscribe if you made it this far. Click the notification bell so you can stay up to date on everything. Leave a comment, let me know what you thought about the beat and also let me know what else you wanna see. Other than that, I'll see y'all another day. Somehow, some way, I'm out.